Okay, so this particular DVD player is a dual DVD. Now, this one right here was stuck. It was not opening. When I pressed the eject button right here, I just heard the motor spinning and it was making clicking sounds. And it was trying to push the disc out, but it wasn't coming out. So what I did was I opened up the unit. It's pretty easy to open. It's just one screw here right there. And there's one on the other side. And then there's a few on the back right here on the edges. And once you remove those screws, just pull it off. All I did was, I noticed as soon as I opened the top part, it started to come out. There may have been pressure from the top piece pushing down on the unit. So there's two things I did. The first thing I did is I put some lubrication. I took a little metal, I put some on each side right here, right here, so I have some lubrication for the drive to go in and out, and what I also did was, the top piece, I just used my hands, and I kind of like, I put both my hands on both sides, I kind of just bent it outward. I just bent it upward like that, and I pushed the two sides like so, I just bent them like that, so I released the pressure that was possibly coming from the top by just bending it upward by pushing the two sides in and upward like that, just a little bit, so releasing any pressure. And by doing that, this could have been obstructing the drive from coming out. Insert the drive. Push the eject button. In. Out. So there you go, that is how to fix a stuck DVD drive on a DVD player. So I hope you found this video useful. If you have, please show your support for this channel by subscribing. Feel free to leave comments. Please like up this video and thank you for tuning in.